Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm filming a very requested video. Ever since I got this purse uh, a couple weeks ago, this is my Tory Burch Square Robinson Pebbled Leather Tote. Um, I just wanted to say for the record I paid for it 100% with my own money so I don't even want to hear anything about um, my parents buying it for me or me being a spoiled brat because I earned all the money to pay for this on my own. I usually like to use purses about this size. This one's from Forever 21 in case you were wondering. It is in my Black Friday haul and I will link it down below if you want to watch that but this is what I'm used to sort of like a clutch with a strap. So graduating to this was a bit of a change. I do have a Madewell tote um, but I usually only use that if I'm like going to a friend's house or like putting books in my laptop in. So this I have been using for my daily purse for a couple weeks now and I really like it. I think I have been converted to the big like mom purse size because I can literally fit anything I want in here. Everything in this purse is just what is in here. I didn't like change anything or move anything around so this is sort of like a me cleaning out my purse thing as well. I've got all sorts of like essentials and stuff so without further ado let's get into the video. Also if you enjoy it don't forget to like and subscribe subscribe I would appreciate that so 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 much. The purse has two main zipper compartments on each side so that like when you open it up they're like lining it so I only use one of these if I'm putting my laptop in um, it does fit I have a 13 inch MacBook Pro so it does fit in this in case I want to use it as a carry-on which is very good for and this little pocket and I think I might have to move the camera down because I have to hold it up this whole time and it weighs a bunch I keep my day designer this is the agenda that I got for school this year I absolutely love it it is a bit pricey but you get a page for every single day which is really nice and it helps you stay organized because it has categories so that you don't have to come up with these. I know it has like dinner and goals and at the beginning of each month you get to like write down your goals so it's really cool. I really recommend it. It's still pretty early in the year so if you want to buy one for 2016 I recommend this one. I transfer mine like from my purse to my backpack because I'm constantly writing stuff down in here. Even if I don't use it as a planner I use it as a notebook just to jot stuff down. Um, I put it in my purse because I had tutoring yesterday so I just took it with me and wrote everything down and it's great and I put some stickers on the back because I didn't know where else to put them. So that's all that I keep in those two pockets. Now we're going to get into the main compartment which is where pretty much I keep everything. There is a little zippered pocket on this side and then over here there are some loose pockets that don't really have any like things to close them. They're just like little pockets. I don't use those. I do however use the zippered one. So in there I have a mascara and a hair. This is my Dior Dior Show Iconic Over Curl. Am I the only one that like when one of my mascaras starts getting kind of dried out I put it in my purse for like touch-ups and stuff? Um, I do that but I really like this and I keep it in that little pocket so that it's easy to find. And then my scent bird. I've had a subscription to them for a few months now. I absolutely love them. Um, I actually partnered up with them for a few videos. Currently I have Warm Amber I think is the name of the scent. It smells really good. It's pretty musky and sweet at the same time and I really like it and it's super great just to throw in my purse. And then the last things that I have in that little pocket are a pencil, a pin from the dollar section at Target, and then this pin from Anthropology, which is like my favorite pin. I take it everywhere with me absolutely love it. That's all for that little zippered compartment. Now I'm going to just move on to the main compartment and just start going through stuff I guess. So the first thing that I see is this pouch and these are my friend's Taylor headphones. I got these for Christmas. I absolutely love them. They're super tangled but I have the white and rose gold ones and they're just so nice for if I'm like at Starbucks or something or even school and I just need to have some good quality headphones to listen to music or a lesson or something. They're really great for that. Next I have my sunglasses. These are the classic Ray-Ban aviators, just the green lenses with gold. They're about as basic as you could get, but I absolutely love them still. I wear these every day to and from driving to school because the sun is very bright. Then I have my emergency pouch. This is from Target. Um, I just keep all sorts of last minute essentials. It's sort of like one of those mini emergency kits, but I made this myself. So I have a bunch of hair ties because I always need those. Um, these little like Colgate Wisp things, they're like little mini toothbrushes on the go. You like, there's a little like gel thing that you bite down on and then you can 
tried to brush your teeth fresh and your breath on the go. Some Zyrtec because I have really bad allergies in the spring and I just keep this in here year round. A little Advil on the go. I'm always getting headaches and stuff so this is always very nice to have with you. And EOS Lip Balm. This is the Sweet Mint. This is my favorite flavor. I love it. Some... What, oh, Zomig. This is for migraine headaches. I get these on a fair amount and if you take one of these when you feel it coming on, it just like zaps it. Best medicine ever. I always have to have this with me. Another hair tie. This one's a bit cuter. A tampon. And some Excedrin Migraine because like I said, always have to have migraine medicine with me and some gas X for if my stomach gets upset or some of my friends are lactose intolerant and they need some of this stuff. <laughs> Alright, then I have a receipt from McAllister's Deli. That's a really long receipt. And another receipt from Surin of Thailand. Clearly I like to eat everywhere. A lens for my camera, which I actually had no idea that this was in here. Which one is this? This is the 55 millimeter. This is just what came with my camera. It's actually a really good lens. I like it because it zooms and not all of my lenses zoom. Then I have some Trader Joe's mints. These are the organic peppermints. Then I have these tech gloves. I wear these when I drive to school in the morning because my car is always very cold because I park it outside. Um, also, I really like them because they are tech gloves so I can still use my phone but not when I'm driving. And then a Bath & Body Works Moonlight Path. I've had this forever. This is just a random lotion that I guess I threw in there. And then a clear loci bracelet. I think this might actually be my sister's. My keys, I have this little tassel which is from H&M. It was like $5, it was so cheap. Um, and then it has a little baby tassel, so even my tassels have tassels. And another lotion, this is the EOS one. I think this is strawberry, but it's pink and it smells really good and I like it better than Bath & Body Works lotions. And then an EOS lip balm. This is like the stick form of the sweet mint. Like I said, that's my favorite flavor. And a wrapper for a mint from Richardson Confections. I have no idea. Business card. And a hand sanitizer. This is Twisted Peppermint. Smells amazing. I'm still gonna use it even though it's not Christmas anymore. Melted Metal Liquefied Lipstick from Too Faced. I also got this for Christmas. I really, really, really like this. This is the Melted Metallic Macaroon color. A business card on the back. It is a free car wash for the BMW dealership. This is really nice. I didn't even know I have this, but I definitely will be using this because my car is currently filthy. And actually, I think that's all. Oh, one more thing. A um, candy wrapper. So, so that is all that I keep in my big purse. As you can tell, I don't really know like what to keep in it. So I just throw a bunch of stuff in that I think I'll use, which I mean, I guess I do use it, so it's worth it. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I would appreciate that so much. Also, all of my social media is linked down below. So if you want to follow my Twitter or my Instagram. Also, I made a new Tumblr blog. It is for advice for you guys to ask me questions. I mentioned that in my last video, but my ask box wasn't open. So I was like, why is no one asking me questions? But it was my fault because I don't know how to work the internet. Um, so now my ask box is open so you can go and ask me questions. Love you guys. Bye.